over there. Might be past this lava fall. You know this. A hunch. When I was here before, I got a pretty good feel for the layout. We need to be ready for Surtur, in case he doesn't want to help us. Ready? Prophecy says he and Sinmara join. But who knows how they're gonna feel about it now? You would try to force these primordial beings into submission. Well, I don't know. We can't win this war without them, right? We gotta be close. I can hear the fort. <laughs> Be headed. Jump! 
Ooh, nice job. I'm really sweaty. Fine, sir. Dear. That's gotta be him. We will ask. Murder? Well, either it isn't him, or he's ignoring us. Come on. Hello. We seek a fire giant. Go away. What just happened? Hey, that wasn't- We deal with these fuck! That is Surtur. He's got a lot to answer for. As you said, we need him. I won't help you. Who are you? Who you seek. And what's left of him. Why won't you help us? I don't... want to. Elaborate. We'll die. Right. Because you've got so much to live for. Not me. Her. So what's the point of all this? You keep separate from Sinmara just so you can sit here and wait to die? At least if you joined with her, you'd be together again. We are together. Uh. 
got her heart. She's got mine. It's not much. But it's enough. But you're not even... Have you ever been in love? It's pretty good. And Odin will succeed. And all realms save Asgard will fall. Yeah, he must die. It's true. But I won't sacrifice her any more than you would him. Sorry. Come. Wait. Those blades. May I see them? fire in those. They are not of these lands. Shouldn't matter. <sighs> yeah. That could work. What could? Put those in here. And I'll become your monster. But I don't want her involved. At all. But the prophecy says you two have to combine. Sure this will work? What have I got to live for? Not here. Follow me. Place where Niflheim and Muspelheim meet. Where the first realms came into existence. You won't be able to get through this, huh? Whoa. Uh, sir? Still, Still me. me. Better than walking. What awaits us at this spark? of the world. Magic, primordial stuff. With that and your blades and my heart, we'll be good. I'll get big, smash stuff. You'll like it. But what'll happen when you change? Dunno. Won't be me anymore. But how will you, or um, future new you, know when to attack Asgard? You got the horn, right? Yeah. Then we're good. So, here it is. The spark of the world. This is beautiful. I'll meet you across. This feels too easy. Odin knows we have Gal Owen. He knows you have the mask. After killing Brock, he knows we would seek Surtur to start this war. But what other choice do we have? None. He knows that, too. This is it. What about Sinmara? Should we at least tell her? No. It'd hurt her too much. More than not knowing what happened to you? Sometimes... ...loving someone is about... ...choosing... ...the lesser pain. That doesn't make any sense. Promise you'll stay away from her. You have our word. Sorter, is stabbing you with the blades gonna be enough to create this new you? Samara's heart is cold. So beautifully cold. Your dad's now got my fire in those blades. 
If enough of me and the sparks fire go into enough of her, it should work. Okay. Come here. think this is going to take? Your name! 
with Gallarhorn when we're ready. Let's head back to Moose Vaughn. We can take the Mystic Gateway back from there. It worked. I can't believe it. We've got Ragnarok on our side. Sorter's plan just worked. I mean, the Valkyries were a small setback, but I bet we've got Odin worried now. He knows we're coming for him. <laughs> Think about it. We're gonna show up to Asgard, and Ragnarok's gonna come in and wreck everything. Odin won't stand a chance. We're gonna win. Gro was right. Gro failed to predict what we would sacrifice in return. Maybe she could only see the big stuff. This is gonna work, right? It must. Strength grows. Hey, check out that cliff. Earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. Ah! More of Odin's forces. Ah! <laughs> 
out of here. So, you fought in a lot of wars, right? You've never had anything like Ragnarok on your side? I have. And the creature does not guarantee our victory. Right. place is going to fall apart if those keep happening. Gonna stop attacking anytime soon. We need to get back. You're quiet. I mean, you're always quiet, but this feels different. I had hoped my days of ceaseless battles were over. I had hoped to, to never see my son go to war. Sigil arrows can break through their shield! Be prosperity! Another Aether Yard! Man, these guys just don't give up! Ragnarok is here! They know what that means for Asgard! Shows up. The gate is just through this crack in the rocks when you're ready. Father, I know we're doing the right thing. Ragnarok has to happen. The price we and others paid for this war is high. It will only get higher. It'll be worth it. Us. 
How did it go? <laughs> and yes, my usefulness to a certain Vanya Numpty did run out. Ragnarok awaits our call. As do the armies of hell. Thanks mostly to me. It seems war is upon us at last. Where to now, brother? We've some time before we're expected at the temple. This could be our last chance, father. Is there anything you want to finish up? do you know of the mask? Only that it was the great passion of Odin's life. He journeyed across Agir's burning ocean into the heart of the silent matron herself to find it. Lost every man in his crew, but to hear him tell it, it was worth all that blood and more. This is it then, the beginning of the end. The end for Odin. And after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. Atreus. I know. We're just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite. They have to. After everything they've been through. They have to. Don't they? Anything in Midgard you want to do? You know, while we still can? Freya and the others are still making preparations for the attack, so there's time. Getting better. Faster. I'd even be better than you one day, huh? If you are not, I have failed. Oh. <sighs> okay. Ready when you are. Well, the armies are probably gathered in their home realms. Waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. Guess I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hildesfini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that, they are reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air, and with Hel's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him, but there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? Sigrun! It's good to see you so... alive. Oh, yes. 
I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the shield maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, I'm here. Please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya, have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion. A siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. I don't care about the honors. I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just... sleep on it? Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. Excuse me. May I have a moment with Mimir? I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more. Except perhaps a dance. Yet do I may have lost a step. <laughs> do you respect love? I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories, me. <laughs> I can never argue with you. Can I sleep here tonight? your mind. I can't. Then I will tell you a story. If I fall asleep, promise you'll finish it tomorrow? Of course. 
No. Close your eyes. There was an old man who chopped wood for his village. Every evening he bore the logs on his back and delivered them to his people. But the logs were heavy and he grew weaker as time went. And one day he threw down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. And he, he called for death to come to him. And when death arrived, He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of you. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us, watching over us. Leading us home? Does my request upset you? Death is a natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. We mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You are quiet? I have nothing to say. Well, say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. The funeral pyre. I would have chosen different. Oh? <laughs> in my land, we entomb our loved ones. You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort.
You once tried to take charge of your ending, did you know? That was different. Circumstance, yes. But not on purpose. future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future that will exist without me whenever that day comes. For you and for our son. You will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. And when you are gone, that part of me dies as well. Say, do you feel your absence? No. <laughs> Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts to it. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. is to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it. What's going on? It is time. I'll meet you outside, Father. Sir. you one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, general. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the temple. Hey, General Kratos! I got something you're gonna want before you go to war. 
Thanks for grabbing that for us. Time to cleave some hands. are some angry knives. Ought to make Odin's spear look like a toothpick! Let's make some magic! Thank you, Lunda. Ah, yeah, big softy. You can thank me after, uh... If, uh, if we all come through the other end of this. I will. Woo-hoo! Looking good! It fits. Now go show it all. And a little one. And a little one. Thanks for this. Mm, know what you want? Brutal. And a little one. Good luck out there, General. I believe in you. General. Sir? General? General? Sir. Hey, bud. Uh, General. did not lead us here, nor will it win this battle. Wars are won by those that are willing to sacrifice everything. If that is the cost of vengeance, so be it. Odin has taken so much from us already. The realms have suffered enough no matter the cost. This ends today. If going out in a blaze of glory means that Odin burns too, might as well be. A big fat smile on my face. For Brock.
steady yourselves. after Niflheim next. They're trying to shut out Ragnarok. You gotta stop those war machines. Not an ideal start. Work to do. You three, follow. Atreus. Freya, with me. Watch our flanks. To the war machines. <laughs> 